It seems like American Idol changes judges more than Nicki Minaj changes her hair color these days. And reports suggest the show may be looking toward former contestant Jennifer Hudson to revive the show from its ratings slump. Hudson first auditioned for the show back in the third season, coming on as a cruise ship entertainer. She got the thumbs up from the show's original three judges, Simon Cowell, Paul Abdul, and Randy Jackson. But her run ended abruptly with a seventh place finish. The season's first place winner was Fantasia Barino. But that didn't stop Hudson. She went on to win an Oscar, a Grammy, a Golden Globe, and a host of other awards for her singing and acting talents. And her albums have also seen impressive sales and racked up some high counts on YouTube. But despite the fame and fortune Hudson has achieved, how exactly could it boost the show, which has all but lost its shine as it enters the 13th season? Since the exit of Cowell and Abdul, Jackson has co-judged the likes of Aerosmith Steven Tyler, Jennifer Lopez, Ellen DeGeneres, Mariah Carey, Keith Urban, and Nicki Minaj. Jackson's recent announcement that he won't be returning has led to speculation that the show has been trying to recruit Idol alums like Hudson, Kelly Clarkson, Adam Lambert, and Clay Aiken. Comparing the previous judges with the Idol veterans, it's pretty clear that their resumes don't stretch quite as far. In fact, if you took Idol out of the equation, you probably would have never even heard their names. USA Today says such a move could be disastrous for the show and would deter any hopes for a new audience base who weren't around for the, quote, glory years of the first seasons. Even the constant catfighting between Carrie and Minaj last season couldn't save the show from its downward spiral. Varying reports suggest Hudson has already inked the deal, while others say her agents have yet to comment. The show isn't expected to officially announce its judge panel before the audition process begins this September. For Newsy, I'm Nathan Byrne. Multiple sources, a broader view.